Hi everyone. This video in our Broker Bay training series is going to show us how to um, register offers on our listings on another agent's behalf. So if we've decided we don't want to allow the agents to automatically register their own offers through TREB, if an agent calls us directly to register an offer, um, this is going to show you how you can record that information on your listing and register that offer on their behalf. Again, this is something that the front desk staff, of course, will continue to do for you. Um, but if you're going to be a little bit more hands on in managing the offers on your listings, um, we wanted to make sure you know exactly how to register those offers on your listings. So let me get my little spotlight here for you. So the first thing you're going to do is navigate to your listing. And you're going to click your offers button. And you're just simply going to click register offer. Then you will be able to search the name of the agent who is registering the offer on your listing. And their information is automatically going to populate. Now, let's say that that agent um, has emailed you their Form 801, so you have that. You can simply click this Attach Offer Doc, and it will open up for you to attach that document to this offer registration. You can also input in here what the irrevocability time is on the offer they've sent you. And once you've input all of that information, you simply click Register. Once you have clicked the register button, it is going to ask you whether or not you would like to notify all the showing agents, only the agents who already have registered offers, or only yourself, the listing agent. You can also choose all the showing agents and then go in and specifically um, take off certain agents if you don't want them to receive that information for whatever reason. So I'm going to say I'm going to send it to all the showing agents. And then um, you can also go in and edit your notification template right from this screen. So this is the email that will be sent out to anyone who has shown the property about how many offers have been registered on the property. So once you've decided what you're going to do with all that information, you simply click register offer and your offer has been registered and all relevant parties have been notified based on their preferences. Just as a side note, as I clicked that button, I did in fact receive email notifications immediately that that offer was registered. So that's how you do it from the desktop version of Broker Bay. I'll now show you how to do it from the app because that's a pretty easy process as well. So once you're in the Broker Bay app, you're going to navigate to the listing, um, to your personal listing. So you're going to be on your listings home screen on your Broker Bay app. And you can click the register offer button on your listing. You'll be able to search for that agent's name on who is registering the offer. And you'll select their name. Again, it will automatically populate with their contact information. And you can choose what irrevocable time um, they're telling you is on their offer. You can also, from this screen, upload a photo or take a photo of the offer summary doc that they have sent to you if you want to attach it right to that registration. Then when you navigate to the next screen, it's going to say, again, go through the notification settings. So it'll say, do you want to notify all the showing agents? Do you want to notify um, only certain showing agents? Do you not want to message anybody? You can choose what you want to do there. And then if you're choosing to notify everyone in this screen, it will automatically populate with this um, notification message. And you can edit that if you wish to. And then you simply click register offer, and then you have gone ahead and registered an offer on that agent's behalf on your listing. 
So whenever an offer has been registered on your property, you will be able to view the information regarding that offer right in your offers screen. So I'll just go back to the dashboard so you can see exactly how to get there. So I'm gonna click into my listing. From my listing homepage, I'm going to click offers and it's gonna show me that I have two registered offers. It'll be able to tell me if I have any offer documents attached, who the notifications have been sent to. It gives me a quick look at the irrevocables, the date the offers were registered, the contact information of the agents who've registered those offers, and the agent's name. By clicking that eyeball, it's going to give me a tracking of the email delivery log, so where things were sent, any notifications. And one of the important things here is if you're sending these notifications to all the showing agents, you'll be able to see under this status part whether it was actually delivered. Sometimes we find that those emails that were given um, aren't accurate emails or they're out of date. So you will see right in this status area, it'll say failed if that email was not able to send to that showing agent. So that was done just by clicking that little eyeball there. You also have the option of managing this. And um, basically it's gonna give you all of that information. Again, maybe you need to change the irrevocable that was um, put on the offer. Maybe they gave you the wrong time. You've gotta go in and change it. Or maybe they've now sent you the offer doc. They didn't send it originally, but you have it now. So you can go in and, and change those things through there. You could also delete this offer. So let's say um, people changed their mind, you could delete the offer and um, it would be removed from the system. So that's an overview of, uh, first of all, how to register an offer on another agent's behalf on one of your own listings. And then a little glimpse into um, how to manage those offers that are registered on your listings. If you have any questions at all about the offer registration process through Broker Bay, please feel free to reach out to any of the management staff or the front desk staff. We'd be happy to help you out. And don't forget that in the comments section of these YouTube videos, we do include the links um, to the Broker Bay written instructions on all of these um, topics. Thanks everyone, have a great day.